back and today I did a 4th of July makeup look um I hope you guys like it I really did I kind of think the lipstick is a little bit too much but hey it's 4th of July and there is red in it so I am wearing my new 4th of July earrings and yes it had to be boots because I love boots and my little hip clip I do not have my outfit on yet but I hope you guys liked the way it turned out and if you did and you want to know how I created this look please stay tuned and let's get started okay so to begin I'm gonna start with the red and it's gonna go right above my cut crease and I'm sorry if you hear noise in the back my boyfriend is cutting grass and you can make it as dark as you want so you can keep applying the color I would say go a little bit dark because once you add the other colors, it's going to start to fade into the other colors. So just And I'm just doing a line. I'm not doing any blending. I'm going to bring it down here. I'm just doing like a line. If you can see like the way this one is. So there's no blending. Just following your cut crease with your brush. Okay, next I'm going to go in with a navy blue. And I'm going to go right above that red color. Kind of like if you're building a rainbow. Do not blend. We want that stripe look. Okay, next I'm going to go on the top with the white color. And um, it's very light, but you can see it in the light. Just go right above that blue color. just like the other side yeah my white is a little bit light but that's okay it still looks pretty okay next I'm gonna go in with my moon dust palette and I'm gonna get that dark blue color for the glitter on my eyelid and I'm gonna apply that with a small brush Try not to get some on the red color, just stay on the eyelid. Just go right underneath that red. So now you have that glitter and I always have to have glitter going on so that's why I added that color. I'm going to go in with um, a highlight. I haven't chosen what highlight I'm going to do yet but well, let me zoom out for you guys. Um, I know I am going to use my Glow Kit Anastasia palette but I guess I'll go with, should I do blue? I guess I'll go with the blue one. I've used it before and all of you seem to like it. It is very, very pigmented, so it's really bright. I'll just put a little bit. And I'm using the blue since we are going with red, bright, and blue today. The 4th of July.
okay. I don't know if I can see it. Yeah, I can see it. And guys, I've um, never worn red lipstick before. And those of you that have always watched my videos, y'all will know I never wear red lipstick. But I um, got red lipstick from a giveaway I had won. I'm going to try it out and hope it's not too, too red. But let's see how it looks. Well, it looks a little bit bright for me, but... I'll leave it on. It is 4th of July and I do want that red and blue look going on. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and move on. I'm gonna go in with um, my eyeliner. I almost forgot to put it on. That's why I kind of look different, but I'm gonna go ahead and add that. Okay, well that is the finished look guys and I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below and see you guys next time.